to our channel. There are quite a few psychology tricks out there. Some are often used by retail workers and some are even used by psychologists as an effective approach to treatment. What are these influential tricks? Well, here are five simple psychology tricks to influence others. Number one, ask for a large request, then a smaller one. So you really want to pet goldfish. Simple enough, right? But your parents won't allow you to get one. You're a responsible, diligent human being. What's the big idea? Well, you might want to ask for a pet dog first. Say what? Yep, I know you don't want a dog. You want a goldfish. And you want to name it Goldie. Yes, genius name, right? Well, if you ask for a large request first, you may just get a yes when you ask for a smaller one after. In psychology, this technique is called the door in the face technique and can be used in many situations. Someone simply requests a lot from you. And then when you say no, they simply lower the amount drastically. So the newer offer doesn't sound as bad when compared. So when you ask for that pet dog, a goldfish doesn't seem that bad, huh? Number two, paraphrase others. Want others to know you understand their feelings? Paraphrase what they've told you and repeat it back to them. This is known as reflective listening. It's a great way to show you empathize with them and brings you closer. Findings from a 2007 research study published in the American Journal of Psychotherapy furthered this theory. The studies have found that when therapists use reflective listening, their patients had a higher chance of disclosing more information on their emotions and their therapeutic relationship with their therapist improved. Are you having trouble clearing your head to stay productive? Are you constantly feeling tired, but just can't seem to fall asleep? Luckily, our sponsor for this video, Endel, can help you out. With the help of their unique soundscapes, Endel can easily create feelings of comfort and safety. Raise your productivity levels and calm your mind so you can get the deep sleep you deserve. But how do they do it? With the help of their AI core technology, Endel updates their soundscapes in real time by using personal inputs such as your location, current weather, and even the time so that they can deliver the most suitable product possible. Want to hear the great news? The first 100 people to download Endel at the link below will receive a free week of audio experience. If you're interested, check out the description to take advantage of this exclusive offer. Number three, mirror someone's subtle behaviors. Mirroring is when you mimic another's gestures and expressions so they can relate and perceive you more like themselves. If you want someone on your good side, this method might work. You could mirror their subtle gestures or simply how they hold themselves. This mimicking of others can happen to yourself subconsciously too. This instance is called the chameleon effect and was explored in several studies. If someone thinks you're like them, they'll want to be your friend. So someone could be mirroring you subconsciously or to gain your trust. Likely, they just wanna be your friend though. Number four, nod your head. According to a 1980 study published in the Applied Psychology Journal, psychologists found that when others nod while listening to someone, they're more likely to agree with them. So remember the chameleon effect and all that mumbo jumbo about mirroring we just went through? Well, if your new friend keeps nodding at the story you were just telling, that in turn may make you subconsciously want to nod in response. And if you nod while trying to get them to agree to something, they might just find themselves nodding in agreement back. Still want that pet goldfish? Nod yes. And number five, ask for a favor when they're tired. According to several studies, people are more likely to be influenced to do something they initially didn't want to do when tired. Think about it. After a long day of work, you're mentally exhausted as well as physically. Do you really want to be up in the wee hours of the night discussing a favor? You'd do anything to simply get to the rest. Even agree to a favor you'll do later, just so you could go to sleep for now, which is why this method works best. So do you think someone has ever used these tricks on you? Were you influenced? Let us know in the comments down below. Do you now want to pet goldfish? Well, it won't be hard to get now. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to click the like button and share it with a friend. Subscribe to Psych2Go and hit the notification bell icon for more content like this. And